So how you can download the free version of Figma and uh, you can use it offline as well. Hello everyone, welcome back to Divine Creators. My name is Shahrukh Khan and I'm your UIUX designer. So in this video, I'm going to teach you how you can download the free version of Figma and uh, you can use it offline as well if you want. So uh, that is a, a bit uh, challenging technique, but it's very easy for us. Like for professionals, uh, they use that technique to uh, how they can use Figma offline. Okay. So first of all, let's uh, get start with the download version, like how you can download the desktop version of Figma and use it for free, or uh, you can use the browser mode as well. Uh, so it's very easy. Let's go to uh, get start first. Uh, first of all, you will need to uh, sign up. I already have this uh, uh, this account in Figma, but what you will need to do is uh, you if if you already have the account, you can go to login, but yeah uh, let's start let's get start so i will click on this button and i will continue with my google account over here Figma landing page over here so you can see uh, the plans over here i like guess view plans you can make new design files new fig jam files and here is my recent file and here are drops so the files that you didn't save in, in, in the team version so it will be in the draft so recent and drops and then delete it okay first thing here i will show you about that is get the desktop app when you click over here on the profile you can uh, click on this get get desktop app and it will navigate you to this page and uh, yeah so it's starting the download setup directly so it's downloading but yeah here let's see the plans over here what it says so right now we are using the current plan so an upgrade to professional uh, so professional is for individual uh, designer who is working uh, as a designer and they want to use some uh, okay some professional mode so in the startup plan you can only create three files three pages and one project and the version history you can see for the files is uh, i think 30 days yeah so it's 30 days only and others options are disabled for the free plan and for the professional you can see that uh, audio conversation is enabled uh, custom files and uh, user permissions are enabled libraries or team wide and uh, version history is unlimited and usage limit is unlimited okay that's great so after this uh, the third plan is for the organization so if you have uh, an organization uh, you are running an organization and uh, you have 10 to 12 or 15 or 50 members uh, you can get this uh, package so it's upgrade to organization and uh, here uh, you can see they are putting all features so you can use these features so here you can see see all features so we are going to use the current plan that is a free plan so after this you can create new design file and uh, this is okay so here you click on the desktop get desktop app and uh, you will click over here to install the figma desktop version yeah I already have uh, downloaded and installed so it's directly opening this for me and uh, what I will do I will click over here on the profile and will go to switch account and will click on add account and here uh, you can see that I will click on the open desktop app so when I click on this it will navigate me to the desktop app and here you can see my new profile over here and it's yeah Okay, so the second thing I'm going to share over here is how you can use Figma offline. Uh, for that, you don't need to uh, close the desktop version of the Figma because when you close it, you won't be able to open uh, open the Figma files because you will get an error to connect your internet. But here is is uh, a technique. Let me close the connection over here and. Uh, I am not closing Figma file because I want to use Figma file offline and here I will minimize it okay I am minimizing it and after this I will click on uh, Figma if you can see over here so I can continue my work 
and Figma file. But if you close it, close it, and again, if you open it, it will give you an error, connection error. So that's the technique over here. You don't need to close Figma, just minimize it every time. And whenever you want to work, just open it, open the Figma from your taskbar and uh, you can use it offline. So let me connect it again. And that was it from my side. So thank you so much and have a good day. Bye.